New shooters often focus so much on gun handling, things like how to grip and stand, that they don't truly understand what they need to see with their sights. I'm Julie Golub, a member of Team Smith & Wesson, here to talk you through how to line up your sights. The most common sights you'll find on handguns at your local dealer are what we call iron sights. They're post and notch sights. The front sight, the one closest to the end of the muzzle, is the post. And the rear sight, closest to your eyes, has a notch in it. Lining them up is pretty simple. You want to aim in a way so that your front sight lines up with the notch in the rear sight on your target. This is what we call acquiring a sight picture. The more perfect we can make this sight picture look, the more accurate we can be. Here are some tips that can help you line up the sights, create a good sight picture, and make that great shot. But before I get into that, if you haven't already liked and subscribed, now is an excellent time to do so, so that you don't miss out on future videos. The first tip is to start with a target that has a defined aiming point. You may have heard aim small, miss small. Well, a smaller aiming point is gonna help you focus much easier. If you're shooting between three and 10 yards, a good size aiming point to start with is about an inch or so. Now let's dig deeper into sight alignment here. As you bring up the firearm on target, switch your focus from your target to your sights. Your eyes can only focus on one thing at a time, and you can either look for the rear sight or the front sight first, whichever is easiest for you to start with. Begin to line up your sights so that your front sight is centered between your rear sight and superimposed on the center of the target. Your main focus should be on the front sight, and it should be crisp and clear with the rear sight and the target just a little blurry. At this point, you can shoot, and if you have good trigger control, you'll likely hit or come close to the center of your target. If your goal is to pile shots on top of each other in a tight group, you'll want to examine your sight picture even more closely. As you look at your front sight, focus on the top outer corners of the post. Then line them evenly with the inner upper corners of the rear sight, forming a straight line. After that, switch focus to look at the amount of light on either side of your front sight. You want to work to even things out so that you have equal bars of light between your front sight and your rear sight. Equal space between the front sight and the rear sight keeps you centered left and right on the target, and lining up those upper corners of both sights keep you in the middle so that you don't drift high or low. By working on lining up those sights and by properly pressing the trigger, you'll hit exactly where you're aiming. For a video on trigger control and more tips and insight on shooting, make sure you check out the links below. Give this technique a try. Let us know how it works for you in the comments section below. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And as always, be safe and have fun.